Welcome to Bush. It's going to be a great day. We're glad you're here. I am so excited and cannot wait to see all the things that are going on this campus. Excellent. Well, we are talking about student empowerment today, and so you'll get to see a lot of things that are happening where the students are taking charge. Excellent. Excellent. So something that we're super excited about this year is we started the house system. So we say that we're five houses, but one home. And so every student and every staff member has been sorted into a different house. And so those relationships will build vertically. The leadership opportunities will go back and forth. So if you're put in a house, you're put in it for the whole time that you're here at Bush. And so I have some students with me that are gonna kind of talk about it. But before we do that, we wanna sort you into a house so you can see how it goes. So you are in the blue house, which is okay. integrity is the character trait and the animal is an eagle. All of our colors go with the feeder pattern. So bush is red and blue, and then we add yellow to pull in Canyon Ridge, and then we have black and silver house. I think it's a good thing to have in the school because then we can build friendships with people that are younger or older than us. Five houses, one home. Help me understand your idea or vision. What is the campus vision for this? Okay, so we wanna make sure that our kids are not just becoming leaders to lead things, we want them to also serve. And so a great way to do that is to serve each other and to be kind and take care of each other. And so this is just another way, you know, they build strong relationships in their classes every year. They may have a strong relationship in their grade level, but the more they feel a part of the entire school and the whole community, the more um, they're gonna feel like they belong. And so that is really our focus and our reason for doing this. And this is the best campus ever. But when I came, I just like, let's just talk about this. What do you think? We visited a school that has this in place already. We talked about it. Does it work for Laura Bush? Because if it doesn't work for Laura Bush, it's not going to be impactful and it's not going to really create the community that, that we have that's so strong here already. I think it's great. And then it just kind of spirals up that it's not just first graders that get to work with second graders and third graders. And so they start having mentors that are older and different teachers and so they're getting an experience that's throughout the school. Even though they're first grade they can understand those four categories that we're really working on in the graduate profile. So this past week we've been looking on strengths for their profile and I tried to find some specific examples of things that they did to show that that is one of their strengths and then later we'll work on thing areas that they want to improve upon and work on. Walking in a Miss Peace classroom I was amazed like wow Tell me what that's like for you to walk into that classroom. It's such a sense of pride, but also just humility that this happens in every classroom all across this country every single day. But just to see her putting all of her heart and soul into everything she does just really makes me proud. It's amazing. And then I made a connection with somebody from my house. They made sure to wave me down. So it was fabulous. Yeah, she pulled me down. She's blue, too. I'm blue. It was just, it was really sweet to see. Those are fun connections. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for coming. We're very happy to have you here, and we're just proud to be able to show the great things that are happening in Leander ISD.